I am in the state of Washington. I got in last night at like 2.30 a.m. I had something really important I was supposed to do today, but it got rescheduled for Monday. I can't tell you what I'm doing here because I don't want to jinx it. I should know by next week. My dad is obsessed with his new car. It is the funniest thing. Today is an exciting day because I get to see my Washington car. I have a California car and I have a Washington car. I know it sounds ridiculous, but let me explain. So my dad called me a month ago and decided he really, really, really wanted to get a convertible. He propositioned me and Shelby into paying for 10% of it. And in return for paying for 10% of it, whenever we are in Washington, we get priority over it because he also has another car, but it's a stick shift and I don't know how to drive stick and I don't really want to learn. Uh, I didn't really want to say yes because I didn't really care that much. I could just Uber while I'm here, but there's something in my dad's voice. Like I think he really, really wanted this car. So I said yes, because I want my dad to be happy. So technically I have two cars, but I only own 10% of the second car. Where are we going? Oh, it's gonna be cold. Does it have heated seats? It has very heated seats. It's Great. Turned on. Back up. When that goes down, then it lifts the windows back up, and it's done. Okay. Yeah. Now it's done. Nope. It's done. It's done. And you just push you that. And what's it say? Right there. It says premium. So you have to buy premium gas. Ninety-one or better. On okay. I got a special song for crazy. <laughs> oh my. We got the back to the fight to use it. Got everything we knew. We just choose it. I won't just be a puppet on the street. That is a beautiful day on Puget Sound. It is. I hate driving. I think cars are pretty cool, but I'm not super into it. But I do like how every car has a different story to it. While we're talking about cars, my mom has a Mazda CX-5 and uh, let's go take a look at it. I crashed her old one. Well, I didn't really crash it. Um, someone crashed into me, but she was sad that her old car got totaled. So she got the exact same model. This feels so weird. Like three months ago, back in January, I was on my way to go see someone who was really special to me. I hadn't seen this person in like four months and I was so excited. I was stopped at just a traffic light and I look in my rear view mirror, a semi truck was coming full speed at me. I knew I was gonna crash and my first thought was how, what the heck world, I'm so, mad i just want to go see this person and you're stopping me from doing that universe why it's crashed into me it pushed me into the person ahead of me and then that person into them and it sucked i'm like being in this exact same car i'm like <sighs> a few months later things didn't work out with this guy now looking back i just think it's so funny it's like the universe was trying to tell me don't go monica we are going to make a semi truck smash into you so you get the picture to not go hang out with this person i wasted a lot of time talking to that person so yeah anyways that's the story it's just weird to sit in here again i don't like it I do not ever want to own a Mazda CX-5. Is this in focus? I'm hoping that this is in focus. I don't know. I have a feeling it's in focus this time. Yesterday my vlog camera battery died so I went to Best Buy and I got a charger because I forgot my charger But then it was the wrong charger. I came home and it didn't work and I was frustrated So I didn't go get another one But this morning I went back to Best Buy and got a new charger so it worked What you're watching today is cut a little bit short It's gonna be like weird trying to stay on track and I hope I don't miss a day But I probably will The first vlog I put up got really good feedback in the comments So just know if you comment I read all the comments I'm excited It's gonna be a fun ride Be sure to follow Follow me on Twitter at Hair Dynamic and Instagram at Monica Church.